What's going on, gang? Vault Matrix here, and today we are taking our look at Q Ranger Kyuzu, the wep or Q Ranger, their weapon. It's a multi changing weapon that can form a variety of forms, up to nine at least. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at it. The first thing we're going to look at is Boenkyo Kyutama, otherwise known as Telescopium, the Telescope Constellation. Seriously, that, that is really a constellation. It's number 20. Next up, the entire set disassembles into three different components. The axe head component, the sword tip component, and then the hilt component. Does have lights and sounds. That's about it. Well, there are other sounds. So this thing has a bunch of lights and sounds, but they go in order, like they go in order of the different modes. So we'll start off with forming the sword. To form the sword, turn the light on, attach that, and attach that. And that's Next up is Q Spear. So to do that, we will first take the axe head out of the equation, attach that, and fold out this plastic piece on the bottom, and that's the spear. Next up is Q Claw, which Take the handle, put the axe in the front. Now this is actually Q crossbow, but then to make Q claw, you fold those bits down and you have a claw weapon. So that's actually pretty cool. Then you also have what I would consider, or what is probably the worst, Q rapier. This is Q, oops, this is Q rapier. Turn the sounds off. Then you have Q, what I'm assuming is dagger. And here we have Q sickle. And lastly, just the Q gun. This is Pink's weapon. Now, the reason I didn't show you the different sounds with each one is because every time you turn it off and you turn it back on, it does this. And then you have to cycle through each one of each one of the weapons. So you have to cycle through all of them, and it gets real annoying real quick. Actually, I think this is a perfectly cool set. You can have some fun with mixing and matching and just kind of messing with people like this. you got the claw with the slasher or the claw with the with the hook. or I'm sorry, sickle. I think this is a really neat weapon. I think this is a really neat weapon. It's a lot of fun. You can have a whole lot of fun with it, and kids are going to love this. Durability-wise, it's made of mostly hard plastic, but then the blades are a softer plastic. Not super, super soft, but definitely softer and more flexible. Overall, it's an absolutely excellent Super Sentai device. And the one thing I have to show you is the sound it makes with this. It make big boom. On the whole, the package is really cool. It's a lot of fun, a lot of versatility, and overall definitely worth picking up if you're a Super Sentai fan. So gang, I hope you've enjoyed this quick little video review slash look at the weapon from new from the new Q Ranger show. As always, I'm Bolt Matrix asking you to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will catch you next time.